Hey there, it's Penny Clegg again with My Two Cents. Today, I just want to make a real brief video and point out, I call it Ben Franklin, the difference between Automagic Incomes Accelerator and work camping. Anybody who is thinking about or has started to do full-time RVing knows that it's expensive and there's a lot of ways that you can fund your adventures. Um, some people choose to do it with work camping. The work camping concept is there's websites and they post job openings for retirees who are out on the road RVing and those people then map out where they're going based on the jobs that they can get and they go there, they work there for a couple of weeks in a little part-time basis and then they go on to the next destination wherever they're they're heading the idea with auto magic is you become an entrepreneur it's passive but um it gives you the opportunity to make a living even while you're sleeping so let's compare and contrast so work camping it is trading time for money straight up it's physical work that you need to attend at a certain time and you are trading dollars for hours. Whereas if, if uh, you get involved in the Auto Magic Accelerator, it's passive. You have five minutes of work here and there throughout the week, but that's it. Other than that, you're not doing any work. You're not forced to be at a place to punch a clock. You are doing it on your time. Now, um, another another issue with work camping as I see it is, the locations are determined for you. You can have an idea of where you wanna go when you're RVing, and you can, you can make do with going through this city so you can work a few days here going through this city, but what if you could just decide for yourself? With Automagic, you can just decide for yourself. Go where you wanna go, when you wanna go, stay as long as you want. You don't need to be constantly chasing those jobs that are on a part-time basis, you know, per diem or whatever, however they're set up. You just do what you want to do. And, you know, your income starts coming in. It's a passive opportunity and it just goes right into your bank account. Another, another issue with work camping is your income is limited by your health, your location, as I said, your hours. Um, there's none of that with Auto Magic. You are completely free to be where you want, doing what you want. If you get sick and all of your plans change, you don't then have to figure out, oh, what am I gonna do? You already know what you're gonna do. You're gonna keep on collecting that passive paycheck. And a huge one for us is if you do something like work camping, trading dollars for hours, you are not creating a legacy. You might put a little chunk of change aside. I doubt it, but you're not gonna leave a legacy. You're gonna spend all of the money that you make, you know, taking, doing what you need to for your RV adventure, and I don't think there's gonna be a whole lot left over. Whereas, with Auto Magic, it's your business. So you can will it to somebody, you can keep on building it, you can, you can have your family, whoever you put, you know, whoever you give this to, you are created a legacy of ongoing passive income for as long as, as long as the company holds up. And trust me, doTERRA is a heck of a company that has a track record like no other. And their products and what they're doing and how they're doing it, the impact that they're making to the world with their Healing Hands uh, Foundation, they're the kind of people that we want to personally be aligned with. Not every Tom, Dick, and Harry who has a warehouse and wants some part-time labor over the holidays or some shipping with UPS. We're looking for something that makes a bigger impact where we can take that extra money that we're making and we can then give it to people who are going to grow that and nurture other people and make this world a better place. Now, that's I'm sure there's a lot more things that we could compare, but for us, just looking at those two dynamics as we, you know, as we're embarking on our adventure, do we want to be pinned down to where we can find a job, or do we want to take our job with us and 
live our adventure, live our life, and make the impact that we hope to, to make on not only our family and us, but on other people in other parts of the world. So that's my two cents. I hope that it gave you a little clarity. If that spurred on more questions, message me. I'll be happy to have a conversation with you and we'll take it from there. I hope that everyone will acknowledge that in this day and age, it's important to find a way to make money while you're sleeping because there are only so many hours in the day. And if you plan on having a retirement where you enjoy yourself, you don't want to be working into your 70s and 80s and be unable to live and do anything except maybe be a greeter at Walmart. So let's talk soon. Hopefully that gave you a little bit of food for thought. Penny's two cents, signing off. Thanks.